In Nigeria, we need not say much at this time about the need to diversify and produce more. With real GDP growth even dipping below the population growth rate, we need speed in churning out large amounts of output. Clearly, the first place to turn to is agriculture. We need agriculture mostly for the sake of reducing the cost of food, which has turned more burdensome because Nigeria imports a significant amount of foodstuffs. And with a low level of foreign reserves, the ease of bringing in much food products has dropped sharply. Agriculture can also provide much headroom for increased manufacturing, as manufacturing as a percent of GDP is at best near the 8% range. Most of the well-known countries in Asia, such as Malaysia, Thailand, Korea, and China, have a manufacturing share of GDP of around 30%. That's why they are like that. Even India and Indonesia have manufacturing shares around 20%. In Africa, except for Mauritius and some of the North African countries where shares are in the 80 to 20% range, manufacturing as a percent of GDP is mostly under 10%. I believe the US's African Trade and Opportunity Act, or GOA, which was renewed in 2015, offers a huge opportunity as has been discussed, to help Africa transform and create jobs. Unfortunately, African countries have not been aggressive in utilizing our goal opportunities, where duty waivers can reach 35%, as in footwear. A pair of duty waiver on the Agua is about 32%. However, so far, two-way trade between Agua countries and United States of America is well below $80 billion and has even decreased sharply in the past couple of years. The United States consumes about 25% of the world's apparel. The EU also consumes about 25% of the world's apparel. So Africa has duty-free opportunities for apparel exports to the United States and Europe. Let us use it. The way to go for Africa is to get African communities to understand all the many opportunities that exist in manufacturing and processing of agricultural products and in the production of clothing and shoes for local and foreign consumption. We can do it. We just need to get our communities prepared and ready. I'm Magnus Paco, and that's my view. Oh, uh -huh.